I have a strong warning for you right now. Please take it to note, okay? Because hardly will you hear this message like how it is right now. Listen very well here. I'm going to give you a scripture reading in the book of Revelation chapter 2, verse 21. Listen, I know you have heard a lot of times that you're going to go to hell, blah, 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 blah. And some of you, you are scared and you are worried. But let me assure you one thing. God won't take you to hell without a warning. You won't just, it's not waiting for you to make a mistake and then pull you in hell. No, he's a God of mercy and grace. So here's how the Lord works. So that you stop whatever sinful acts you're doing. And then you learn, you pray for the mercy of God and for God to help you so that you stop whatever you're doing that is bad. So listen, in the book that I've just given you of Revelation, the Lord said that he had given Jezebel time to repent, but she was unwilling. Hence, he was coming because she's been given chance. So listen, the Lord is not intending to just let you live a good Christian, God-fearing life only to catch you by surprise. First, he will give you a chance to repent. So listen, don't be scared, but be willing to repent. And listen, he won't wait until you make a mistake, then he pull you to hell. He will give you enough time to repent. And the time when he takes someone, when we go to heaven or when we, I mean, when they go to hell, listen, he is able to explain that. Do you remember this time, all this period, I had been warning you. I, this was your time to repent, but you were just unwilling. So don't be scared. Just don't be comfortable living in sin. Pray daily and be willing to repent the moment God gives you a chance to stop sinning. And I pray for you right now. May the grace of God be upon you in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And see you next time.